Welcome inside the film room. I'm Dustin Fox alongside Bernie Kosar. As always, Bernie, we're going to look at the Chicago Bears offense today and a quarterback that we all know pretty well here in Northeast Ohio. Yep, I like to go back. I don't like to show my age, but going back to the mentor Cardinals to watch him play some big games here and playoff games. So it's fun to watch a guy from Northeast Ohio play like this. Yeah, what do you make of his rookie season? I mean, he's only started nine games, and the way John Fox is ran the offense there, or at least the way they've called it, they've been real conservative with how much they wanted him to throw the football. Their wide receiver situation is not at all what a young quarterback wants. So from their offensive perspective, they want to run the ball and use the play action fake, the nakeds and the bootlegs or something Mitchell Trubisky will be running quite a bit against us yeah. on the few times that he does throw. Yeah, and the running game has been obviously very effective, as you mentioned there, Bernie. Let's dive into some of this tape. And you know Jordan Howard, who you know, he's got over a thousand yards this season, averaging about 80 yards a game. Is uh, is one of the best backs in all of football. Yeah, and he does a really nice job here. You can see some of the fundamental ideas that Chicago has. The Bengals are actually in a perfect defense to stop this run, but a phenomenal job of the right guard pulling around and hooking it, and Howard, the back, staying tight. A lot of young backs, they get wide and they miss this first gap on the power play like this. Mm -hmm. Cincinnati Bengals run two guys right out of the run lanes. Poor technical defense here, but outstanding job by the offense here. Yeah, 22, he's got to be much more patient. I mean, that should have been his play to make. And that free safety, Burns, look at this free safety for a second here. This is a run play, you know? He's backing up, he's hesitant, he's gonna get up there and make that tackle. Well said, I mean, everything here says it's gonna be a running play. Even down to the right guard with about a half a step extra depth in his alignment, these are the type of things Chicago's been doing throughout the year to, to take the heat off of, of their rookie quarterback. Well, the running game obviously sets up play action pass, and for the Bears, Bernie Trubisky has made a living this season off the play action pass. Yeah, basically the, the majority of their passing game stems from the running game and this play action pass. This is second and one right now. This is actually a really good down to, to throw a play action pass. Again, especially given the steps of the line for the Bears. You saw in the last play, on a running play, the whole offensive line in unison was reestablishing the line of scrimmage down the field into the end zone it would be if it was a running play. Here a pass play, they're holding their ground, holding their water, stepping back. This, this also screams play action pass. The tight end has a wider alignment. He's probably two steps out from the right tackle. Typically in running plays, they're, they're foot to foot. In pass plays, they have separation like this. So that you know it's a pass play. We shall also be anticipating these type of tells that give your defense a big heads up that this is a play action pass. And Trubisky shows fantastic touch and you can't beat a perfect throw. Thanks again for joining us inside the film room. He's Bernie Kosar, I'm Dustin Fox. That was a look at the Chicago Bears offense.